Before we start today's video, I wanted to give a huge shout out to today's sponsor, MuttPacks.com. You can click the link down below and open exciting packs, win tons of coins, and withdraw your account right away. You could use promo code CHU for 15% off. Lastly, when you sign up down below, you can get a free 10,000 coin pack as well. So as you guys know, there is a brand new wide receiver, Deion Sanders, and this card is actually pretty dang good, and you can get him for free right now inside of Madden. I'm going to show you guys how to get him for free, and we're going to do a gameplay on him, so if you guys enjoy videos like this, make sure to hit that like button, hit that sub. We are on the road to 25,000 subs, and let's get right on into it. I am actually on my guy Pluto's account. Mine, I did do, I'll show you guys why I couldn't earn it on mine. I grinded all yesterday to realize I couldn't even possibly get it on mine, but the only way you could have got it is if you saved your competitive pass before zero chill came out if that made sense because if you come all the way down here i already hit this requirement right here this is why i didn't get it because i already had this before zero chill came out the 25k xp but you can see there's xp in here that will help you as well there's another 25k right there i already had this one as well before zero chill came out but then there's plenty there's like a 50k right here and then there's a last one right here with another 25k but if you go over to zero chill there's a lot of grinding to do over here and Deion Sanders is right here at 220k XP so you can do objectives just like this all around but like I said it is not possible to do unless you have your full compass because I have done almost all of these and I'm still like 30k off so I'm missing a couple more of those XP but let me show you what Deion Sanders looks like right now on the Legends team team I'm excited for this card all right so like I told you guys our guy Pluto does run a Legends team team so he is going to be a 94 speed on the team he is only a 92 overall but for having 93 speed and being six foot and with really good stats it's actually not that bad of a card and when you look at him 91 spec catch and then the rest are 92 and then the route running he is using the purple route tree strat card which is a very good one in the game it's very meta and it's also only like 60k so i recommend it 100 percent it has 96 short route running 91 medium route running and a 94 deep right there so this card looks really good apart to a lot of wide receivers in the game and then his discounted abilities he does get uh, deep out of leap for one route tech for three is not really a discount so i wouldn't recommend using that at all and then he will get short out elite which not as good as short in so we're going to be using short in here today at 2 ap and our deep out elite at one and then obviously let's get that double me on him and hopefully we can get that x factor lighting up i'm really excited to use dion he's always good at wide receiver every single year in the game Let's see if we can go off with him. All right, boys, we are getting into a game here. We're playing a pretty good team right there. That's a really, really good team. He has 96 is all above, and it looks like we're going to be home, so hopefully we can lock on and get the ball here first. I'm excited, man. Deion Sanders is always really good in the game, but looks like we're going to be on D first. All right, let's see what he's got for us here on first and 10. It looks like he is just going to run a trap right here, so I... It definitely messed up right there. Normally, I can get the trap for negative yards, but I think I was a little late on it. The hurry up already is kind of crazy. It's, oh, it's, it's literally 10 a.m. on the dot right now. Hopefully, we're not going to get the hurry up all game because we just didn't get a sack right there. Yeah, we're getting the hurry up all game. This is pretty nasty. I'm not going to lie to you. It is too early in the morning for hurrying up every single play. But let's see what he's got for us here on second and 11, boys. Looks like he is giving us a lot of audibles, and we're going to guard the underneath routes right here. And we're going to get ourselves another sack. All right, he's actually hurrying up again. I am guessing pass over. He runs here. He probably is. All right, he's not running. Let's see what he got. And another sack. Three sacks in a row. No way he hurries up here on fourth and 23, right? Yeah, I was about to say, you got a pun right there. We'll take our rock back every single day. We'll see what he comes out in. We'll see if we can get Deion Sanders going crazy. We're going to try to win this game no matter what right here. And we're going to just wave this one on off with the other Deion Sanders. All right, so it looks like he is running dollar as well. A very good defense in the game. That is what I run myself. But let's see if we can get our guy Deion Sanders open over here on the right side. And it looks like we are going to do so easily. He does have some KO, so we got to be a little bit more careful and run away after we catch the ball. All right, boys, let's see. We're going to keep him a little bit honest here. We want to get him out of dollar. I hate playing against dollar in gameplays. I think it's like one of the harder. I like playing against it normally, but in gameplays, it's pretty hard to get everything going. And I'm actually going to quick snap this play and see if I can get our guy, Deion Sanders, wide open. And it looks like maybe over the top right here. There it is, baby. Come on, Deion already looking amazing. I'm actually just going to try to run right here. This guy does have Dexter Lawrence. He has actually a really, really good team. I want to see if I can get something. It's really hard to punch the ball in personally down here. And also, Dion is out of the game. He's tired already, believe it or not. Let's see if we get a good run going in. And our guy, Barry Sanders, will take a seven-point lead right there. Dion with two catches. 
around 40 to 50 yards already. He's looking great. The defense is looking good. And Barry's looking amazing as well. It's some bad news is, is he is going to get himself a free touchdown right there. A kick return. Probably the least favorite thing in man. I feel like kick returns are like... Technically, he only ran down the sideline and we just missed the tackle and we got unlucky, but that's Madden for you. Like I said, there's really no skill in kick return. I mean, I guess there is sometimes, but that one right there, just a broken tackle down the sideline. Whatever, we get Dion back on the field. Looks like he's actually going away from his dollar. So I already did click a run play, so I'm just going to run it right now, but we'll see what he's in right here and obviously adjust. I actually don't know. Is that a cover four? It is a cover four. So let's see if we can get going on this next play here. Even though the special teams and the defense in a lot of these videos, oh, he's already back to dollar. Oh, okay. Well, I came out in a play to stop that. That actually kind of sucks. I'm not going to lie to you. And it looks like he is running a blitz though once again. Dang, I actually can't. I wanted to play a little bit of, uh, I wanted to play a little bit of cover four. I was saying, although our defense and special team sucks in a lot of videos, but actually, you know, we're only here for the offensive card. You know, it could be literally, I could be losing by 28 as long as I'm showing off the Deion Sanders card. I think we're in a good spot. Yeah, it looks like he is going to run the cover to blitz the entire game right now. That's what it seems like it's going to be. First and 10. Let's see if we get something going here. And it looks like Deion, kind of a risky ball. And Deion is actually going to moss that guy. So it looks like he actually went to match. I know how to beat this one. So yeah, he's going to run that the entire game. We do get ball to half, so I'm actually going to try to see if I can work the clock all the way down. I think we're in a good position to do that. And he's in dollar, which is a pretty easy formation to run against if we can go consistently. All right, we're going to wait down to the three minutes, and then we're going to snap it so we have only two more plays, and it looks like easy easy man we don't want to go too far we need to chew this out as you guys could see he did go back over to the four down lineman this is what we want him to be in we want him to be in the four down lineman look so we can have more play potential hey he came back out in this i'm gonna run it one more time but i i don't know if he's gonna stay in this the next play let's see if we can get something going here on the next run not so much but the clock is still moving believe it or not he actually stayed in this i don't know if he blitzes out of this cover four i don't think so let's see and it looks like our guy dion maybe oh that was too risky of a ball man the match coverage sometimes can get really glitchy that was a good play but we know we know this guy likes to run the trap play and a lot of vertical routes let's see what he does here obviously we get ball a half so we're still not in the best format or position as we were but still not in a bad spot and how does he have this much time this got to be a that was insane. I don't know how he just had a million years. We just sent five. All right, let's see. It looks like he is running the trap right here, and I could not get off a block. I couldn't even, like, pay that guy, like, $10 million. I couldn't even get off that block no matter what I wanted. It was insane. Adrian Wilson has, like, 89 blocks yet, too. I know it's not terrible. That was, like, ins I've never seen something so bad, but Adrian Wilson going to make up for it. Let's go, baby. A second and 11. Let's see what we're doing. We're actually blitzing a lot of people right here. We're guessing pass, so if he runs, it's going to be absolutely screwed. Let's see what he's got going for us here, though. Looks like a lot of underneath routes. A fumble is going to happen. Clock is still moving. Third and 22 right here. Remember, we get ball at half, so I'm not pressured at all right now. Hey, third and 22, boys. What can we get going right here? I probably should have blitzed that other guy as well, but it looks like good defense, and oh, we're going to take the timeout. Let's go, boys. All right, I'm going to be honest. I did not expect him to run this play again, so I am not 100% ready for it, but let's see what we can get going here. And we do have our guy wide open underneath, but not the best play in the world. Oh, that was nasty. Hey, right, come on. Second and five. Let's see if we can get it going. And our guy, Dion, can he get us in field goal range? We're going to get down. I think we're there. I don't know which kicker Pluto has. He has Graham Gano. This should be an easy hit for us right now. Dion does have 76 yards receiving. He is looking amazing. And like I said, we get ball at half. If we can hit this field goal, we're in an amazing spot. And I think we hit it pretty easily. To end off the half as well, let's go score a touchdown and go up top by 10. All right, he went back to dollar. We got to keep him honest. You know, we got to keep him humble. We're going to run the ball a little bit. You know what I mean? We got to keep him out of this. I don't want him in dollar. I'd rather have him in his other formation. But as you guys could see, dollar, even if you do get some pass, or you get some pass rush, five yards still. All right, it looks like he's going to his cover two in this formation. Let's see. And it looks like we're actually going to have him wide open underneath. We'll take Barry Sanders every single day. We're in conservative as well, so we should not fumble at all. I don't know if he's running his match or his cover two out of this, so let's see what we can get going. And it looks like Dion is going to be wide open again. We're going to swerve out that Atwater hit. Dion already above 100 yards now. Just saw it. Dion is at 99 yards. No touchdown, by the way, but he has looked pretty good. This guy's playing pretty solid defense this entire game. And it looks like Dion is going to be wide open again. 
There goes the 100 yard marker we needed. I know he's been running some cover four, but I want to see what he's got here on this uh, second and 10. It looks like we actually might have a touchdown. Ah, he has KOs and he's running for it, man. This guy, like, it's like he knows exact. I ran that play once and it was like the second play of the game. There's no way he knew. I'm going to throw out this running back route right like this. Hopefully, he can distract the user a little bit right now. Let's see what we can get going. Looks like he's probably going to run with it again. And yep. There it goes. I'm telling you guys, usually when people play like this, you can start to catch them off guard when they're playing so desperate to stop one player. All right, here we go, boys. Fourth and three. We're looking about anything. We need anything to pick up this first down. Let's see what we can get going right here. And it looks like maybe Dion. We're going to come back to the ball, and Dion Sanders to take a 10-point lead is going to catch a touchdown. Like I said, this guy has been playing really well all game on defense, but... He has not had a single point on offense besides the special team. So I'm feeling really good right now. All right, boys. I hope you guys enjoyed the gameplay. We did take that 10 point lead and then I slowly just chewed the clock out. It was an all right game. It was very boring to play against, but I ended up just chewing the game out. We went up by 10. It wasn't a very fun way to watch the end of the game. Anyways, you probably didn't want to watch it, but I hope you guys enjoyed and I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace out, boys.